Hello guys, I decided to do another Lady Train pack opening. Um, uh, reason being, this isn't a good pack, I know, I realize that. However, at the same time I realize that the chances I'm going to get a pack that will give me about 2.5% chance of uh, pulling a character that I don't have maxed out are getting thinner and thinner with each day that passes. And judging from my previous experience, spending 220 euros for one copy of Nightwolf, I would like to just forget that and the best way to do it is by just spending some souls, you know, souls are like safe guys, souls are cheap, souls are free, so yeah, we have to agree that uh, it is very very easy to farm souls in MK Mobile, so yeah, basically I'm just going to let you enjoy this video, it is me opening packs and yeah, there is a twist, I got something really good, what it is, I'm not going to tell now, so sit, relax and enjoy. Free and dive into the sky. Hear the wind crying out its prayer. While we are so ashamed to be alive, break the chains and our freedoms are to take. Okay, so I have to be honest, I had 1% chance of pulling MK11 Rain in the previous card opening and I pulled it anyways and I had, I don't know how much, 1.5 or 2% chance of pulling MK11 Shansung and yet I got another copy of him today. 
Uh, basically, with this speed, probably I'm going to max them out, both of them, in two years with something. But still, I'm happy because that was crazy lucky. Uh, extremely lucky. Still, I'm not convinced that 15,000 souls are worth two diamonds. Uh, even though one can argue that they're new diamonds and they're more expensive in the sense that they're more valuable. And I would agree, however, MK11 range isn't better than Classic Lucane, for example. <laughs> but still, Classic Lucane is a very, very old character. Still, MK11 rain isn't better. So, what I would say is if you are, let's call it this way, if you are a whale or if you have almost maxed out account like me, I mean, there is nothing to waste, like there is nothing to lose. You just have to go ahead and spend souls because probably we're not going to get in good discounts soon or probably the discounts you're going to get for some characters that we already have maxed out already. Uh, so, yeah, I think that... This pack was horrible, but I completely enjoyed it. I spent almost all of my souls, so if this pack comes back, <laughs> I won't have souls to open it. And yeah, I'm not buying souls, you know, to open it, it's not worth. Uh, basically, for the new characters, you know, the way you develop them is you either pay or you have to wait a long, long time. And I'm actually willing to wait, guys. I'm not going to spend crazy amount of money to max characters that I don't need. Because quite honestly, I can com complete every tower, every challenge using my current maxed out diamonds. The only reason why I would like to have, for example, Shang Tsung or MK11 Rain or I got Liu Kang is because I want to have a maxed out account, right? But the question is, is it worth? And I would say it isn't. Now, I love MK Mobile, even though I don't love it that much compared to, let's say, two years ago, but it's a good game. Sadly, lately, the chances of players getting um, new characters are really, really thin, but I hope that at least they're going to give us some crazy good, and I mean that, crazy, crazy good discount around uh, Black Friday. Still, we cannot guarantee that, but we can expect, or what they can do is they can give us a discount uh, for money packs, which will infuriate a lot of people. Uh, but once again, guys, kill the past. This is not the same game that we used to play two, three, four, five years ago. It is a brand new game uh, having the same name, but when it comes to monetization, uh, the way uh, this uh, game treats the events and the discounts, it's a completely different monster. So we have to accept it sooner or later. Okay, guys, this is going to be all for me today. See you next time. Take care and stay safe. Goodbye. Perfect.